What is up, YouTube? Flourish RLC, and I'm here with Cod Gamer two two nine eight. And we're, I thought it was Black. Ba I thought it was Black Bandit. Fuck Black Bandit. <laughs> Whatever. Like so we're here playing some draft champions, and I think I'm gonna go with Rex Ryan and Bill's playbook. All right, so here we go. First round. Please give me some good. Co please, I want Flashback Vic. If I get Flashback Vic, I'll go freaking insane. Oh, we get Jared Hain. Oh man, that's so cool. If you don't know, this is the guy that he used to be a he used to be a rugby player. Now he's in the NFL. I'm automatically gonna draft him just because he's a freaking badass. And I wanted to play with his mutt card, so uh, you know. <laughs> so I kind of had to get him. And I guess we're gonna go with Orlando Franklin, even though he doesn't have the best stats. But I don't really want Eli. I'm kind of gonna bank on me getting. Oh, all right, okay. We get we get a right guard, Zach Martin. You you have to get a good off. Off offensive line. That's kind of the thing in draft champions. If you don't have a good offensive line, you might be completely screwed. Um, I'm gonna go with Chris Culver. You need good cornerbacks as well. If you don't have good cornerbacks, you're again you're gonna be screwed. And we're getting we're not getting the best choices here. But Bruce Irving, he's an absolute beast. 95 pursuit, 88 speed coming off that end. Deadly, just deadly. Give me some elites. Come on, please, Madden. Oh, are you serious? Where's my elite, bro? Should I go with Derek Carr? I mean, I don't. No, don't, don't take him. I'm gonna go with Phil. Yeah, there. get some more line. Well, we dig. Oh, here we go, elites. Oh, we got, we got Mario Williams or Brandon Flowers. I think we're gonna have to go with Mario Williams. A solid left end, good power move, um, good strength, I guess. We could go with Flowers though. I don't know, Des. What, what do you think? Go back to Mario. I think you're going to go Brandon Flowers on this one. Brandon Flowers seems like the better choice on this one just because of his speed and his coverage. Looks pretty okay, decent. all right. Oh, here we go. More elites. Oh, yeah. We got sweet. We got Andrew Luck. We got our QB. That's sweet, right? There's your quarterback. There's my quarterback. A Luck. Can't go wrong with Andrew Luck. Craziest I need some more leads. Oh, we got more leads. JB Collins, Marcel, D D Marcel Darius. Oops. Oh, 94 block shed for a defensive tackle. Stuff the run for you. Oh my gosh, yeah. We're taking him. Well, we we have to take him, man. We have to. Oh, we got more leads. Levante, David, or Kyle. Well, wait, no. We're we're running a three-four. So this is a no-brainer. 98 pursuit, 97 tackle, 95 play rack. Levante Davis or David. Good luck getting anything past him. And, ooh, ooh, we got, oh, we got C.J. Mosley. Dude, our, our linebacking core is scary right about now, wouldn't you say? I agree with you. We're going to have to go with a very, very Oh, yeah, here we go. Come on, more elites, defense. more elites. Ah, dang, we didn't get any elites. Jeremiah Ratliff. Or should we get another 93 speed at the cornerback? That'd be a good slot cornerback, right? Are you slaying? <laughs> uh, see what you did there. All right. You got that one. All right, we need some safeties, though, man. We need some safeties. Oh, oh, dude. Dude, Joe Staley, he's a freaking... But Jared Cook's got 87 speed. And you know how I like that out route play, or that PA power O play. And he'd be perfect for that with his speed. A and his release. His catching's pretty decent. I think he'll be good. Should yeah, be. yeah, I think we're going to go with Jared Cook. All right, here we go. We need some more elites. I can feel an elite. Ew, gross. Ew. <laughs> it, I mean, like, ew. I don't even know what to say on this round. I guess William Hayes, that's kind of like the only logical thing to do i guess i think this is our legend round yep it's oh we got gilbert brown the grave digger but we need a safety and rod woodson i think is gonna be the way to go we did just get a let i mean jason taylor would be cool he can move one to the other side but we don't have any safeties and i don't want people to just be burning us deep he's got 92 speed yes he's got good zone so Rod Rod Woodson, I think we're an 81 overall. Okay, that that's not bad. A lot of teams are 80 to 82 overall. You rarely see people with like you know absolutely stacked teams. Normally, people will have players that are you know really good in one spot, players that aren't so good in in another. So uh, a pretty solid a solid team to to say the least. So I'll see you guys into the game. I'm Fluttershy, and this is Call Gamer 2298, and we'll see you in the game. All right, what is up, guys? We're into the game. First game, and look at my opponent. He's got Jason Peters, Joe Thomas, and he's got Ray Lewis. But we got Jared Hain, the pain train, and I'm honestly really excited to play with that guy. I, I Honestly, I loved how his card looked in Mutt, 
And, you know, because he goes for 100K, I'm not about to spend 100K on a running back that, you know, pretty much, you know, his stats aren't, you know, that spectacular compared to Giovanni Bernard. But I still just, I mean, the guy's just a badass. You know, he used to play rugby. You know, the dude's got, you know, great speed. He's got great power. So he's just perfect. So I had to go with him. Now, right here, this is something you will never, ever see. A guy, he's punting it on fourth and one. Is this a fake video? Am I faking this? This has to be fake. This has to be a fake video. Who punts it on fourth and one? Well, this guy did. And I kind of was like, well, I appreciate the thought, but the favor probably won't be repaid. But, you know what I mean? We'll see. So, again, Andrew Luck, Jared Cook. I got Cook for that speed and that route running on the end. And Cook getting us to the 25. So, a good chance here. So, you know what? We're going to hand it off to Jared Hayne. Look at Hayne. Stiff arm. And Jared Hayne is gone for the touchdown. How did he get free? How did he get free? Unbelievable. He's already making plays, man. If you if you had that 49ers mystery box and you got Jared Hayne, then you got I'm pretty sure you got yourself one hell of a running back, even though I probably would have sold him first and then, you know, bought him back later on for cheaper, but still, that dude's a beast already. I mean, he just he ran past like three people. That's how freaking amazing he is. And then of course Rod Woodson drops the ball. So now second down and ten, he's got Teddy Bridgewater, and I know because he Bridgewater's on my Mutt team. Now I don't know if it's me. But that Bridgewater makes plays. He just makes plays somehow, some way. He makes plays on my Mutt team. So third down, he's forced to a fourth down. And he's punting it again like, whoa. I mean, people rarely punt in Madden. You guys know. Especially, like, you know, I mean, I still cannot get over the fact he punted on a fourth and one. Like, pretty much nobody does that. So, Andrew Luck, we're going to find Fells down, the st um, um, down underneath, picking up another first down on second down there. Luck having a pretty good game so far. So, you know what? Let's give it back to Jared Hayne using that power. And now it's funny because, like, his character looks nothing like him in real life. His helmet isn't even the same. His body type isn't even the same. He probably doesn't even have a neck, if you see. And uh, Luck fumbles the ball, and he's going to take this all the way for the touchdown. But he laterals it back for some odd reason. Um, but, I mean, he has the ball at the 7. But why would you do that? Why would you do that? He still throws a touchdown to his to his running back to tie the game. But, I mean, I don't understand why you lateral it back like that. I mean, sure, he still scored. It doesn't really matter. But still, I don't, you know, I don't get why you do that. But, hey, whatever. So, you know, hand it off to Jared Hain. And uh, hopefully he, he can make some plays. Because, honestly, I'm already loving that guy. I think he's an amazing player. And, uh, honestly, I really hope he succeeds in real life. I mean, coming over from uh, being in rugby. And rugby... It's a lot more violent. You you have to be a lot more, um, how you would say, physical. You have to be a lot more, you know, pain resistant to play rugby because you're out there with no pads. And if you just if you see this dude's highlights from you know his rugby games, you'll see why this dude's a freaking badass. I mean, he's just unbelievable. So um, you know, really, really do enjoy his card. Look at that, taking a big hit from Ray Lewis and holding on to the ball. And so he's going to get another touchdown. He scored both of our touchdowns so far. One in the receiving game, or no, one, no, two in the passing game, excuse me. I don't know what I'm talking about. And that gives us the lead again going into half. We get bought half as well. And Jared Hain, he's bringing the pain, man. He's, un I mean, just, I'm loving his card. I think his card's amazing. I think he's amazing. So if you see this guy, you might want to think about picking him up as we get the toe tap animation for the first down getting us to the 47 yard line again handing off to Hain Hain not able to get much there but still having a very effective day he's scored both of our touchdowns third down and five luck out the pocket Andrew Luck's gonna scramble misses a tackle Andrew Luck down the sidelines and Luck getting us down to the 17 yard line what a play by Andrew Luck and you know what we're just gonna throw it to Hain Jared Hain on the screen pass for the touchdown giving us a 21 to 7 lead and Jared Hayne has all three of our touchdowns. The dude's a beast. I mean, you know, the dude, he is backpacking us on those big, strong shoulders of his. He's backpacking our team, man. He's doing it all. And uh, just, you know, what a great pick. I know I could have gone with Russell Wilson. and uh, I can't remember who the other guy was, but I could have gone with Russell Wilson. But it's paying off because I got Andrew Luck later and Jared Haynes is, you know, I think he was the right choice right there. So on third down, he doesn't get it. And he's going to rage quit. So we win the first game of the Draft Champions season with Jared Hayne. If you guys want to see more with this same team, be sure to let me know, and I'll post that. So anyways, guys, I'm Fluttershy. I hope you enjoyed this Madden 16 Draft Champions champions game again if you want to play with me my gamer tag is fluttershy space 5 fdp send me a message if you want to play i'd love to start playing with you guys i'll see you guys on the next one peace out have a great